The sound of water dripping at night when we're trying to sleep is one of the most annoying sounds and this is the most common experience that we have with dripping water. And in the song Sol from the film Ponni in Selwan, which is an epic historical fiction film, the word Sol itself is tuned to sound like dripping water. Now, why would composer A.R. Rahman base the tune on something which is annoying to most of us? That's what we're going to see in this episode. Welcome to the Suvay Sans channel. I'm Sukrish. Archetype characters are those that are frequently found in literature across the world. The princess's female companion or sidekick is one such archetype character. We find such characters in the Bible, in ancient Tamil poetry called Sangam poetry, and even in the Disney film Aladdin. And this kind of character is important because the audience gets to know about the princess's thoughts and emotions based on the conversations between the princess and the companion. And this song is one such conversation between Princess Kundavai and companion Vanati, who are going on a boat and teasing and talking about their romantic lives. Now, if you've ever had a crush on someone, you know how it goes in the beginning stage. You think you might have feelings for this person, but you're not sure. But your friend is so sure that they know more about your feelings than you do. And they're pressuring you. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, who is it? Who is it? Who is it? And nudge, nudge, wink, wink. And under all that pressure, you come to a point where you have to admit to yourself that you have feelings for this person. And the annoying friend is somewhat like the annoying dripping water, you know just to make them stop you finally blurt out your secret of who the person is you know just like you don't really want to get out of bed but just to make the water dripping stop you get up ha you being persuaded so it's a very good match between the word sol which means tell me and the water dripping sound <laughs> The soy or essence of the song is the persuasion. There's also this interesting humming going on in the background. <laughs> it's like, I'm not going to tell you who it is. <laughs> and it's also like, I'm going to make you confess. So it has this nice teasing playful quality and much of the background music is derived from natural sounds in the scene. We have the boat going through the river. That sound is used in a rhythmic way. <laughs> we also have the sound of the female anklets. <laughs> It really sets the mood as an all-female girl talk kind of song. This entire movie has the river theme. In fact, the title of the movie is Ponni in Selvan. River Ponni is very important and the reason why the kingdom is flourishing and the river is a witness to everything, including the romantic lives of the princesses. So this entire water theme is apt for the film and the composer has done this in such a way that people in the audience are able to make the connection he's placed the lyric sol right next to the water drop sound in several places <laughs> I love it when an artist uses a symbolic meaning and the viewer is able to 
get it. And this is kind of a takeaway lesson for composers. If you want the audience to get it, place the lyric right next to your symbolic sound a few times. They will make the connection. The song actually made me quite curious about what causes the dripping sound. Until recently, scientists assumed that it was the impact of the water drop on the water surface that's causing the sound, but apparently that's not the case. I was quite surprised to find out that only recently, scientists have figured out the exact cause. Um, there's actually an air bubble underneath the water surface that's causing the sound. I've left a link to this research work in the description. If you're interested in sound design, you might find this paper interesting. I always like to think of music as connected to everything else, the physics, the sound engineering, linguistics, human perception, human feelings, everything's connected. And I always like music to be a stepping stone towards understanding many of these things. I hope you enjoyed this episode. See you on another episode. Check out other videos on this channel and don't forget to subscribe.